A Parks Department worker in Yonkers allegedly used a gun and zip ties to kidnap someone he knew from a street in the Bronx. Prosecutors say they then drove to a place to get intimate photos and videos off a cell phone. CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports. Investigators say this SUV pulled onto Metropolitan Oval near Unionport Road in Parkchester, picking up a victim prosecutors are not naming and describe only as 30 years old. It was a kidnapping, they say, with one man a stranger to the victim and the other familiar. The suspect is identified as Yonkers City Parks employee Owen Drain, now in custody and charged by the feds with armed kidnapping. Stunned were his neighbors in this Yonkers apartment building where he lives with a longtime girlfriend. I know his girl. Girlfriend. I would have never, I swear to God, I would have never suspected that at all. I know him for a lot of years. I'm shocked. Every time I see him, he'll say good morning or good job. He, you know, that pays well. He was like a hard-working man. The early evening crime on November 19th included a Kraus County drive from the Bronx into Westchester, with the victim not only held at gunpoint, but also zip-tied. Police say the destination was a mobile technology store in Yonkers, and police say the kidnapper's intent was to wipe clean the victim's phone to get rid of intimate photos and videos on the device and in the cloud. It is near the store that the victim finally escaped the SUV and called police. No word from investigators if the second man has been found. Officials with the Yonkers Parks Department tell us Drain works in the Shade Tree Division reporting to the Arborist, and they also tell us he is suspended. If Drain is convicted on the kidnapping charge, it carries a maximum sentence of life in prison. In Yonkers, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News.